हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू सी द डच नेशनल फ्लैग प्रॉब्लम व्हिच मींस वी हैव टू सेग्रीगेट जीरोस वंस एंड टूज टुगेदर इन एन एरे मींस इफ दिस इज द एरे सी वी हैव टू टेक ऑल द जीरोस टुगेदर मींस जीरो हाउ मेनी जीरोस आर देयर 1 2 3 4 5 सो so, 1 2 3 4 5 all the ones together 1 2 3 and 4 and 5 okay and twos together so 2 and 2 so there are two twos so this should be the answer okay now see how to do this now you will say it is very easy just count the number of zeros and put it at the beginning of the array then count the number of ones and count the number of twos but we have to do in the least time complexity means we have to write a solution which takes the least time complexity it should be efficient so the solution which takes only o of n time complexity is here now in this solution what we do is that we consider one element will be present in the middle see segregating zeros ones and twos together does not mean that one should be in the middle even two can be in the middle or zero can be in the middle you can select anything which remains in the middle you have to select it as a pole means i will say it as a fixed pole whenever you get zero in this array then you have to take that zero on the left side and whenever you get two in this array you have to put that on the right side of the array then automatically all the ones remain in the middle so that is the concept behind this algorithm so let's solve this problem so that you can better understand now the indices for the array are here so 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 and 11 okay now let's see this algorithm the first variable is low equal to 0 high equal to n minus 1 so 0 high is n minus 1 number of elements are 12 so n minus 1 is 11 n is the total number of elements in this array and mid is 0 okay see this mid variable is going to trace the whole array mid variable is going to visit all the elements in the array and it is going to check the value of those elements for example if mid is 0 it will go to a of mid means array of mid so that is zero so this element is zero then whatever the process we have to follow that so let's do that so see a of mid that is a of zero is zero so the element is zero see low high and mid these are indices and a of mid is an element in inside that indices means inside that array now while mid is less than or equal to high so mid and high high will be starting from the end of the array and mid will be starting from the beginning of the array and this loop will continue till mid is less than or equal to high so let's solve now see as a of mid is 0 in this switch case switch a of mid means switch 0 so what is case 0 this is the case 0 this is the block of code for case 0 if a of mid is 1 means if you are here suppose second index a of mid is 1 then we will go to case 1 and if a of mid is 2 then we will get go to case 2 so a of switch condition for a of mid switch condition for the element in that array now swap a of low a of mid so you have to swap a of low and mid 
see both indices are zero so you have to swap this zero with itself so it remains zero as it is now after this step you will perfectly understand this algorithm the first iteration is a bit confusing swapping the element with itself but after the first iteration clearly you will get this algorithm this is very easy now low plus plus mid plus plus in the when we swap zero with itself you have to increment low and mid so increment low low plus plus and mid plus plus okay high will remain as it is right now the next loop see switch a of mid what is a of mid here what is a of 1 is 1 okay now what is case 1 see you should not do anything you should just skip that element that is case 1 and you have to do mid plus plus see you are just incrementing mid means when you are I will just clean it when you are pointing to element 1 1 as 1 is our fixed pole as I had told you you remember 1 is a fixed pole so we are skipping that means we are hoping that we will not do anything for 1 if we get 0 we will take it to the left side of 1 if we get 2 we will take it to the right side of 1 but if we get 1 we will not do anything so that at the end automatically all the ones will remain in the middle so let's see how it works so case 1 only increment the mid in the, uh, the mid variable means we are skipping that uh, element that is 1 now so all other indices will remain the same 1 11 that is incremented mid is incremented to 2 now a, what is a of 2 that is 1 so again a of mid is 1 so again increment and just skip that element just pay attention you will get everything now a of 3 is 0 a of 3 is 0 so what is case 0 swap a of low and mid see low and mid you have to swap 1 and 3 now this is a major thing now here see all the zeros should be on the left side but after you encountered 1 you have encountered 0 this means that 0 is on the right side of 1 on the right side of any element which is 1 means any of the ones so you have to now take it to the left side of 1 this is why we are swapping so you will swap this uh, low with the mid that is 3 so currently low is pointing here and mid is pointing here so 0 will come here and 1 will go there now see 0 is on the left side and 1 is again in the middle so whenever you encounter 0 just swap it with 1 so that 0 goes on the left side ok now after doing this obviously low plus plus mid plus plus so 1 becomes 2 and 3 becomes 4 and 11 remains as it is ok now a of 4 a of 4 is 1 again so as it is 1 let it be in the middle and we will just skip that element we will go ahead so that is mid plus plus means it is 5 ok now 2 will remain as it is 11 will remain at is, as it is and 5 so now a of 5 what is a of 5 is 2 yes so now we have encountered 2 so now 
uh, as it is 2 so we will go in case 2 and we will swap mid and high so let's see what is mid and high so mid is 5 and high uh, high is 11 so 5 and 11 5 and 11 so swap them so one will come here and two will come here okay now after doing this we have to do high minus minus so high will be decremented to 11 will be decremented to 10 2 will remain as it is then uh, mid 5 will remain as it is see mid remains as it is I will tell you the reason in few next steps okay now and a of mid is again now 1 that element is changed now a of mid is 1 so when it is case 1 what we do mid plus plus and break means we skip it so it will become 6 2 will remain as it is then it is 10 it has been incremented to 6 5 has been incremented to 6 and 1 so a of 6 is 1 a of 6 is 1 so again skip 7 again it is 2 10 7 and a of 7 is 2 see a of 7 is 2 now so mid is here and high is 10 so high is at the 10th index okay now see you have to swap this so 0 will come here and 2 will come here okay now after case 2 only high minus minus high minus minus that is 9 and 7 remains as it is because see in case 2 we don't increment mid or uh, anything now why it remains as it is here or here why the mid remains as it is when it is case 2 so the reason is here see now mid if mid increments then 0 will remain as it is here so mid remains the same whenever it is case 2 because the element which came from swapping here it was 0 at first by swapping this 0 came here right so the element which came here after swapping is not surely 1 it can also be 0 that element can also be 0 so which is why we have to again check this element and if it is 0 then we have to perform the operation of taking this 0 to the left side of these ones or we have to do something so which is why whenever it is case 2 the mid remains same only the high variable decrements okay now see so it is 7 what is a of 7 is 0 so now case 0 low and mid are swapped so low is here low is 2 see here low is 2 and mid so 0 comes here and 1 goes here see this 0 came to the left side of all ones now let's go ahead so in this step low plus plus mid plus plus because we have swapped low and mid here so low plus plus mid plus plus so low is uh, 2 so it will become 3 and mid will become 8 ok and high will remain as it is see a of 8 what is a of 8 is 0 a of 8 is 0 so again we have to swap so what is low low is 3 so low is 3 now see low is 3 and mid is 8 this so swap 0 and 1 so 0 will come here and 1 will come here see again 
all zeros came on the left side of all ones now after this step again low plus plus mid plus plus so this low is 3 after it increments it will become 4 see as i i don't have space here i will just write it uh, here the last step okay so 3 will become 4 uh, high will remain as it is 9 and mid will be incremented to 9 because mid plus plus so a of 9 is 0 a of 9 is 0 so as a of 9 is 0 again k 0 is low plus uh, swap low and mid so uh, you have to swap low and mid low is 4 so low is 4 and mid is 9 see so 9 and 4 so 0 will come here and 1 will come here ok so mid and uh, they both are swapped and now mid low plus plus and mid plus plus so increment low so this 4 will become 5 when we increment then this 9 will remain as it is this is the last step mid will become 10 ok so c it is uh, mid is 10 and high is 9 so mid is less than or equal to high condition is not satisfied now because mid has greater value than high so this loop will stop here and program will come out of this loop ok now c is the array segregated yes 0 0 0 0 0 0 1 1 1 1 1 and 2 2 so all elements are together now means all elements are segregated so this is how we perform dutch national flag algorithm in the most efficient way that is o of n time complexity hey friends please subscribe to my channel as i post algorithm videos every day and if you want a video on any particular topic then please mention in the comment below thank you